Someone could be living in there. They can't see us. Wait, there, film strip. Oh my gosh, there's more film right there. It's, it's super scary. <laughs> That's the window. There's a hatch. Is there a ladder? Hello everyone, my name is Em and this is Kelly. Today we're gonna go explore an abandoned drive-in movie theater out in the middle of the woods, just outside Joplin, Missouri. So let's go see what we find. We are ready for adventure! Yeah! Take that tree! We have chosen this stick as our weapon of protection against anything that might be in here, just in case you were wondering. We got ourselves some tires. These actually look like good tires. Someone just came in here and said, eh, I don't want these tires no more. I'm just gonna stick them right there. I mean, I guess when you buy the property, getting some tires is kind of a nice bonus. Yeah. And over here, we've got what used to be a rocking chair. We should tip it back over. But then again, I don't really want to touch that. <laughs> You touch it and just like explodes. It's a, bit dusty, it's a bit crusty. Crusty, dusty. If anyone ever wanted to know what the underside of a rocking chair looked like, that's what it looks like. Onwards! Looks like we got another tire. Mattress. Another mattress. Looks like someone's trying to wash their clothes. They got their downy. Yes, they do. And the scrubbing bubbles and another tire. <laughs> Someone was trying to clean up this place. That used to be a couch. How, how, how does something, no. Oh, oh, it was a love seat couch. Yeah. See, that's stretched out and that's there. Would not want to sit on that. And way up ahead is actually the road. Cause this is, property is hidden in plain sight. Oh, well, there it is up there. I can see it. Pretty cool. Guess we gotta figure out how to get in. That was a truck, but that sounded terrifying. Okay. I don't like that. Oh, what do we got here? Well, looks like somebody decided that they wanted to paint their mattress blue and they didn't finish the job. Wonder what happened to them. Sun glare, aesthetic shot. Woo! That's a rusty old tub. The questions that I have. Oh dang, people have been dumping stuff here. Look at all this. That is not one person's trash, that is many. What is this stuff? Like I said, it could be stuff. That's definitely a mattress. What used to be a mattress. <laughs> oh man. Someone could be living in there. I don't know. It's slightly quiet. They run after us, you have a stick. Somebody stacked that one on purpose. But Let's just see if someone in there. Just... Yeah, but we can still just approach it cautiously, but we need to know what's the easiest way to walk in there, because... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa, watch out for things. Okay, so this is the abandoned Cine 360 Mini Art Theater. It was built in 1971 and it closed in 1985. This has been here since 1985 and it's 
somewhat still here, but walking around here, you can see all the layers of this place have just peeled away. And all the windows have been shattered out, the glass is still here, you know, there's even still film strips left here, and straws, the bathrooms are still here well enough. This place used to have 118 movie screens in a big circle around the whole building, and they would project outwards onto those screens. And they started out by showing normal movies, but they eventually narrowed down the audience to adult movies, and then they put up a fence around the whole place. This land is currently for sale, so I don't know if I'll get to buy it or not, but it is still here, and you can still come and look around here. According to this other webpage, it used an autoscope system, which was actually made by somebody from somewhere else in Missouri. It says, using mirrors, the movie was delivered to a circle of 120 windshield-sized screens, and then they all closed down and stuff. Okay, so this is supposedly, well, it's a photo of one of the places similar to this, but you'll get the idea. Yeah, so this place used to be a lot bigger, but around this building is literally just dense woods. Super scary. <laughs> no, you should look. It's smashed to bits. Oh my god. Somebody. Well, no, the stuff caved in from the roof and fell down and smashed them. That is so scary, dude. Don't touch it! It's, it's just a shell. We call, I always call them crunchies. <laughs> that was terrifying. <laughs> so that's where it went. I was wondering where that was. Okay, and vines and pokey things. I should be wearing my hoodie. Ah! Hello. If we don't make any sudden movements, the place won't collapse in on us. And don't touch the walls or the ceiling. Watch where you step as well. What is- oh, this looks like a storage closet. This place has seen better days. Way better days. Why did I step right in the mud? Oh! Ooh! <gasps> That's the window! This stuff was, must have been blown out. Oh man, that's like the main part of the roof collapse. Oh yeah, you can see straight through. Yeah, see, we should have kept going through that door. What do you bet that this is maybe where they stored the films? Somebody said once that they used to be remnants of stuff like that here, but I'm guessing it's all washed away. Oh, whoa. They're just straws. And like, well, why is there so many of them? It's probably the concessions. The fact that that's still here, though. That is a heck ton of straws. Hey, look up there. 
There's a hatch. Is there a ladder? Please don't. I'm not climbing up there. <laughs> straws. That, that is a lot of straws and cups. For them to have. If that is still here from the 80s, I am shocked. So if anybody needs any straws, we got them. Wait, there! What? A film strip. Do you see it? Do you see it? No. Where is it? Like right there by that cup to the upper left from the from the installation. Dude! Real film! Oh my gosh, there's more film right there. Dude, do you see all that? Mm -hmm. It's just all really dirty. I don't think there's necessarily anything on the film. No, well, it could have faded by now, theoretically. And above our heads is the top of the roof. I have no idea how they got up there, but we're not gonna find out. I can't tell if that's like a zhuzhi picture on this piece of film or not, or if it's just dirt. It looks like it's a picture. Oh, there's some grime on it. Corrosion? But it's dark, it's not white like the other films. Can you flip it over somehow? Ooh. That totally... Or it could be dirt. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. It looks like a picture. It almost, yeah. Oh, there's just like little pieces of it everywhere. So when they abandoned this place, all the weather just came down on it, blew up the, the container of straws, and shredded the film. Here used to be shelves. Maybe, maybe this was the room where they kept the film reels. Whatever's in here, it's basically a movie theater exploded and this is what's left. And it's 70% straws and 30% other. If I touch the ceiling, do you think it'll cave in? I don't want to know. <laughs> Proof of camera! <laughs> this got pushed out. One, there, there's no door, unless this used to be. the guy's bathroom. Oh, let's go in the guy's bathroom! Let's see if the guy's bathroom is more destroyed than the women's bathroom. Oh my gosh. Oh, it looks the same, but pretty bad. You know the wasp nests on the wall? That's just a little terrifying. It's almost equal amounts, you know, destroyed as the other one. There's no door though. At all. Remember, like, even the women still had the ladies' door. This has no door. <laughs> I should end the video with, that's all, folks! <laughs> it's a video. <laughs> The group. <laughs> yeah. Sure. <laughs> well, we don't want to follow it. It's gonna lead us down to the. It's gonna take us to where it takes our other his other victims. Holy! Do you see that? Yeah, I think it's from my daughter. Yeah, it's from my daughter. <laughs> I'ma get me out of here. If I could escape. And guess what? They can't see us, but we can see them. Right here are all the wooden posts where the screens would be. See, there was one car wide, and there was a bunch of them all in a circle. They literally go around and around in both directions. And goodbye, old movie theater. 
time to go back to the real world. Hello, cars. We're just looking at some prospective property. Magical! The fact that all these wooden posts are still here from 1985 and yet there was no screens. Maybe someone came along and took all the screens. You never know what's behind the trees until you go exploring. Isn't that right? That's right. Oh my god. There's a boat. There's like an actual boat surrounded by a bunch of old tires. And there's tires in the boat. I've never seen an abandoned boat before. I say we hitch up that boat right now to the car and go home with it. I don't think it floats. <laughs> nope. It's pretty crazy. That is so many tires. Who took the time to bring out an old boat and all these tires into the middle of the woods. I don't understand. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed that video. I definitely did not expect there to still be film strips in this place since it's been abandoned since 1985, which is a long time to be abandoned. So if you enjoyed it, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please click subscribe because we will keep making videos like this as long as you guys enjoy watching them. And follow us on Instagram, It'll be here on the screen somewhere. And have a good day. See you next time. See you next time. <laughs>